was watching you know uh, looking to get a uh, weekly D O two happened that uh, a few things that was running through my mind because one uh, I was going through pondering whether I should I do this uh, feng shui and I decided hmm since Gary is doing a podcast on feng shui right how is it possible that uh, no sorry he was doing his own podcast I was wondering can I do a podcast on feng shui so uh, if you are listening to this uh, this segment due to feng shui Okay, can you just drop in the comments below or be whether you're viewing it through the video or through the podcast can you leave a comment below and let me know especially those people learning, listening on podcasts let me know how to better improve right because podcast offers convenience while you're taking the train or you're commuting to somewhere else so let's hit straight <laughs> Basically, uh, the previous video which uh, I did was exactly from showing a home in uh, Alpha, Alcaf Court View. Okay, uh, it, I was doing it for a client who wanted to ask more about, about health. Today is uh, 28 January. Mornings invested some time to review uh, the feng shui audit that uh, Dato Joey was doing incorporated some more points in thus uh, now it's more specific the difference between the first video and, and this video is that the Shenkong flying stars I know that uh, it faces north tree 8.4 degrees and apparently there's something new there's going to be a water body at the northeast prior to recording this video uh, I was looking at the plan then notice that there's going to be a water body and that kinds of like change part of the environment and probably yes tomorrow 29th january 2020 gonna uh, take a trip down because apparently i think it is uh, we are able to access it right now so want to do a much more detail since yes i need to be professional if i want to make this uh, as part of my side gig professional side gig okay what I'm gonna do today is basically just a quick snapshot let's assume that this uh, building facing I've got it correct 8.4 degrees faces north tree uh, because my own home also faces north tree that's where I discovered that the two bedrooms here this bedroom uh, let me circle it okay this bedroom and this bedroom it has the combo 2-5 and 5-2 okay so here's 2-5 here is 5-2 not the best type of uh, flying star combinations that we want in that feng shui audit that uh, Dato Joey did there was this sector that had three five and in that place uh, the metal sculpture was there to weaken the five and the tree was weakened by the uh, fire and candle so since uh, two five both elements are earth putting the metal sculpture will be down there same thing use the right sun dates to make sure that the effectiveness is boosted okay so since i have to do this consultation with a 25 there what am what am i going to do first thing let's do a small tai chi right let me just reset the whole thing okay uh, let me use the finest pen okay use the red we we'll do the small tai chi which i'm drawing in uh, i think orange oh dear Okay, I'm gonna box this box this up. And now we're in this small tai chi, which is the best uh better sector to keep it. So since I did the calculations before I recorded this video, initially in the first video I said that the uh the bit should be here, right? Yes it is, but now I'll prefer that they move the bit to the corner which is this part. Let me just use a different color. 
this part. Move the bed within this part. Okay, and it happened that uh, both the husband and the client, uh, they are of Gua Tri. Today I learned something again about the East group and the West group. So the husband and the wife is forced into the East group. So the North, the South, North, South, East and East are all the favorable directions. Since this house already takes to the North, so definitely they are already facing the East. In this bedroom right now, which I previously had suggested right now, definitely they won't be able to sleep here, right? Anyway, since the door is there also, they will have to sleep in this main bedroom. But they just have to move it to the corner And for the son however they, He is of Gua 8 And that places him in the west group The favorable directions are Southwest, Northwest, West and Northeast Since this home is facing North South, West and East right? If I small Tai Chi that small bedroom right now There's a 1, 6 here And there's a 6, 1 here I'll definitely place the bed right now in this sector already, this corner which I'm colouring in purple uh, because since the fa uh, the ceiling star is 6 6 we know uh, is the metal element that, that weakens the earth energy the sector supports the well, uh, the health next thing is the health, about health is the stove right so you, we do the same thing, we do a uh, a square, a complete square off, right? So let's do, assume we do a square like that, as shown in the pop, uh, as shown in the green, no, oh, orange. Okay. So you see that the six one is here, at the southwest. Right. So I will put the stove there too. If you really want to be anal, you can place the stove. The stove not since the homeowner and the client is in the east group definitely uh, they no matter which direction north east or south which cannot be right so left, left with north of east right uh, that would be definitely uh, better directions so now it's more of a even more detailed manner of how I want to uh, do this whole consult. After that, I'm going to pen down all these things and pass it back to the client.